Hey guys, what's going on? So today I have my list of my top 10 favorite death metal bands that I said I would have in my top 10 thrash metal bands video. So, um, yeah, death metal is definitely my favorite subgenre of metal. So it was really hard to fit 10, um, just 10 bands onto this list. But, um, because of that, I have a lot of honorable mentions. So those are Devourment, At the Gates, Dismember, Skinless, Impaled, Exhumed, and Deicide. So, uh, yeah, I really wanted to fit Deicide onto the list, but, um, there are more bands I found that I liked more than them. But if it was top 11, they'd be 11. So yeah, but number 10 is Entombed, had to have at least one Swedish band on here, and Entombed is definitely my favorite Swedish death metal band. Left Time Path is just perfect, I actually just ordered it on vinyl last night, it should be coming in the mail sometime. But um, yeah, Clandestine is really great, and um, fucking Wolverine Blues is really good. I don't really care much for anything after those albums, but yeah, Entombed is just amazing, and uh, legendary guitar tone, very buzz -y, great riffs, very thrashy. If you're new to death metal, um, Entombed is a band you should check out. Um, they're a little dry, some people think, which, I, which is understandable, but they're really good once you get into them, so yeah. Number 9 is Autopsy. Um, I had to have them on here, just a legendary band. Um, I absolutely love Severed Survival, Mental Funeral, and uh, their third album, Actually the Unspeakable. Uh, they're all just really great. Uh, slower death metal, not quite Death Doom, but pre ah, pretty close. Uh, <clears throat> amazing gore lyrics. Just really entertaining. I really like their artwork, especially on Servant Survival for the Zombie Surgeons, which is great. So yeah. Number eight is Carcass, one of my all-time favorite bands, really. Um my favorite album from them is definitely Sydney's and Sickness. It's just absolutely disgusting sounding death metal. And uh Rick Puncher Faction is also really great. And my second favorite is probably Necroticism. Hardwork is also really good. I got into that album before any of their other stuff. Even uh Swan Song is pretty good in my opinion. And I haven't listened to Surgical Steel, but they just have a great discography. They're a very versatile band. And, um, they just do every style that they've adapted really well, to be honest. So, yeah, number eight is Carcass. Number seven is Obituary. Uh, I thought they would be higher on this list, really. Because for a while, they were my second favorite death metal band, and they were one of the first death metal bands I really got into, but I've just found more bands I like more than them. But John Tardy's vocals are fantastic and very unique. And the guitars are just really groovy and catchy and headbangable. And, um, they're just overall a great band. My favorite album from them is probably Cause of Death. Um, so, yeah. 7 is Obituary, 6 is Suffocation, legendary band, uh, one of the first brutal death metal bands, if not the first, uh, they were the first band to use slams in the history of death metal, so yeah, um, you know, Legion of Embracy, just kick ass, um, heavy as fuck, Frank Mullen's vocals are really good, the guitars are very technical, and the drum beats are just monstrous, and just awesome, Effigy of the Forgotten is a masterpiece, and I also really like, uh, Pierce with, ah, Pierce from Within, so yeah. <coughs> Number five is a band that I always felt doesn't really get the recognition that they des ah, that they deserve, and that's Malevolent Creation, a legendary fucking band, but they just aren't as big as like Deicide and Death and Cannibal Corpse, and Autopsy and Obituary, etc. But um, they're just fucking amazing though. Um, Retribution is one of my all-time favorite death metal albums. Slaughter of Innocence is just a perfect song. Um, Take Him Out is also really damn good. Just awesome lyrics. Um, they're about like serial killers and shit. Uh, the vocals are extremely pissed sounding compared to a lot of the other death metal bands, which is something I really like. There are certainly vocalists who sound more evil or more scary or more disgusting, but the vocalists from Low Creation just sound very angry, which is something that I really like about them. And um, yeah, they're just a really amazing band. So yeah, number five is Low Creation. Number four is Morbid Angel, huge fucking band, one of the biggest death metal bands ever, probably the third biggest death metal band to be honest. And um, yeah, Blessed of a Sick is just perfect in my opinion. And, um, that's my favorite. I also really love Alters of Madness, of course. And, um, fucking Covenant. Um, just really great. I really love the musicianship, especially from Pete Sandoval, the drummer. And Trey Azekloth is one of my favorite guitar metal, ah, guitar players in death metal of all time. I keep stuttering this video, I don't know why. But yeah, I just love Morbid Angel. I had to have them on here, as much I need to say. Number three is Dying Fetus. Uh, they're the first brutal death metal band I got into. Um, heavy as fuck, but one of the things I really like about them is that they're really brutal and really heavy and extreme sounding. But at the same time, they're also very catchy, and their songs are memorable and very well written. They're technical when they need to be, but they aren't like overly technical to the point where it's pointless and it's just flashy. Um, they're just a really great band. Uh, ridiculous band name, but what's funny is that the lyrics aren't really as crazy as the band name. Ironically, most of them are about like politics and stuff. Uh, but they're just an awesome band. My favorite album from them is by far um, "Destroy the Opposition," and I also really like "Killing from a yeah, Killing on Adrenaline." And um, their second newest album, I forgot what the fuck it's called, but the one has a red album cover. It's really popular. I don't know why I can't remember the name of the album. Um, 
but yeah. Number two, Legendary Band, Death. Um, I know so many fucking Chuck fanboys are going to shit on me for not having them as number one. But they were my favorite death metal band for a while, but I just like my number one on this list more than them. But Leprosy is my all-time favorite album from them, and my second favorite death metal album ever. Um, I also love Scream, Woody Gore, and Spiritual Healing, and just all their albums are great, in my opinion. But, um, I don't know. I love them, but I like my number one more. There isn't much I need to see for, say for death, really. Chuck was an amazing fucking just musician in general. So, yeah. But number one is definitely Cryptopsy. I've had Nuts of while on CD for, like, five or six months. I got it, like, last September. I don't think that's five or six months. I miscounted. Whatever. Um, Nuts of Vile is just fucking perfect. Brutal as fuck. Really technical. Um, the drumming is absolutely amazing. Lord Worm's vocals are insane. Um, the fucking guitar work is really just uh, awesome. And the bass work, um, occasionally when you can hear the bass when the band kind of breaks and, like, um, that one part of Slit Your Guts. It's just awesome. It's fucking chaotic as hell. I also love Blast Me Made Flesh, and their third album is pretty good, too. And I forgot the name of their fourth album. That one's good, but everything after that is kind of eh. But fucking None So Vile is just perfection. Just 30 minutes of insanity. And they're one of the heaviest death metal bands, in my opinion. And, um... Yeah, there's much I need to say. I just love the shit out of Cryptopsy. I just can never get enough of them. I listen to None So Vile on an almost daily basis, and I just never get sick of it. I don't know why. But, yeah, I just love the shit out of Cryptopsy. So they're definitely my number one. But uh, that's it for this list, though. I hope you guys enjoyed. Remember to like, comment, subscribe. I'll do Black Metal, my top 10 favorite Black Metal bands, sometime soon. So, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys later.